Hello comic book fans, let's talk about a different kind of comic book. This is from Class Comics, it's called Alex in Bonerland. This was written and illustrated by David Cantero. Just to say this up front, all Class Comics are very adult, there's generally a lot of sex taking place in it as well. Lots and lots of sex. Because of all the adult content in this book, I'm very limited in what I can show in any type of preview format. As the title suggests, it is a play on words from Alice in Wonderland, but in this case, Alex going to Bonerland, he's still going to a very fantastical place, but there's lots of sex taking place. He's also running into several other characters that have their own comic books in the Class Comics universe. For instance, he's still chasing after the White Rabbit like Alice was, but in this case, he's chasing after Harry from the title Annie Males. There's some very comical aspects about this comic too. Some parts I wasn't expecting, some of which I thought were pretty good, especially in line with the whole sexual aspect of everything in the comic. I don't want to give away any spoilers, but I do like the idea of certain characters from the Class Comics universe replacing the characters in the Alice in Wonderland story. It seems like some of them fit in perfectly. You pretty much know the story as it unfolds because we've all heard it and seen it before in the past. It's just more compact because it's in one issue of a comic book. I also like the idea about when he met up with the Tea Party and he met up with the Mad Hatter, he was given a gift or at least given something back to him. I know that's very vague, but I don't want to spoil it for anyone. It is still a really awesome idea. Something I haven't really read too much on in any other comic book. Instead of calling it a Tea Party, they called it a Happy Deflowering Party, which, oh my god, that is awesome. Awesome. David Cantero's artwork is pretty damn good too. It works really well with the whole comical aspect of the story. The only thing I didn't like about this comic is I thought that it could have been expanded on. I really think this could have been a three issue miniseries having his full adventures going through Bonerland. So anyways, I can't really talk too much more about it without giving away spoilers about everything that happens. But you do know the story like I already said. It is Alice in Wonderland, but it's Alex in Bonerland instead. Check it out when you get a chance. You want to go to classcomics.com, you can order it from there. That's it for now. Thank you guys for joining me in this comic book review and I will join you another one very soon. Peace.